Hi guys, this is Debbie and welcome to Debbie J's Crafting Corner. I've been sick for the last couple of months so my crafting mojo is basically gone. So I'm using this as a great opportunity to use the time to reorganize my stash for the new year. Today I'll share how I'm storing and organizing all of my stamps and dies. Last summer I stored everything in clear plastic sleeves and, and plastic shoe boxes. The shoe boxes are starting to split, so I need a better solution. Also, organizing by category, like I did last year, didn't really work out too well. So I upgraded to the Interdesign Linus Poles plastic bins and found a really great deal online. I'll be linking everything that I've been using down below for you. The bins turned out to be a, of great quality and really sturdy, but they aren't quite wide enough for the plastic sleeves. So I decided to try storing them on their sides. Problem solved. So what else did I do? Each stamp sleeve has a cardstock insert and is labeled on both sides so I can see it from either side of the bin. And I made new cardstock dividers with my envelope punch board. Here's an example. But what about die storage? The only difference is that I also put a magnetic sheet cut from a magnetic bent cover to hold the dies. Now everything is stored and organized by manufacturer and I keep a current inventory in OneNote. I've done a video on how I did that so you can check that out as well. This helps me to if I ever have any trouble finding that perfect stamp for that project. So thank you so much again for dropping by. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe, and happy crafting.